What is up to the gang? What is up to the mystery squad? I am back with another mother freaking video. And right now I'm about to be telling y'all a story time. The story time is unusual. I never really seen no one do a story time like this. But the real reason why I'm doing this story time is because people always ask me, Zachary, what made you start singing? How did you find out you had a voice and all this stuff? So I'm about to basically tell y'all a story time on how I became a singer. Not like a singer singer, just someone who knows how to sing really well and knows how to control their voice. So yeah, I know y'all wanna see other videos and stuff. And yes, I do got those videos coming up. I'm doing a collab on Friday, actually. So y'all stay tuned for that. And yeah, I do got some more lit videos coming y'all way, but I just wanted to do this video because a lot of people wanna know what made me start singing. And you know, the sun's right there and I can just be chilling, laying down and telling y'all the story time. So that's what I'm about to do. Let's get right into it. Make sure I give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below your thoughts at the end of this video. Subscribe if you're new with post notifications on and all that good stuff. Let's go. All right, so everything started like this. When I was younger, about my nephew's age, like six, seven, Justin Bieber, he was like a big thing. I'm pretty sure everyone watching me knows who Justin Bieber is. He was like a big thing back then when I was younger, like seven, six. And a lot of people liked him. I even liked him. Um, not like that. I just liked like his music and how he sings and stuff. And one day I had stayed home from school and I put him on demand. I still remember to this day. I put him on demand. If you know what on demand is, you can click music movies and all that stuff you want to see i played his music and i would take the remote and pretend that i was singing like him i always wanted to be someone like that sings even when i was younger i used to have dreams of me as like a young adult or like an older teenager older than what i am now singing on tour or whatever so honestly i already had the dream to become a singer um i'm still trying to accomplish that dream hopefully that does happen i don't know leave it all in God's hand. Um, and yeah, that's what I used to do. I used to just pretend that I was Justin Bieber singing on the microphone and stuff. Then from there, that was my old apartment. Well, that was me and my family's old house. We moved from there and we moved into the house that we're in now in like third grade. And every day for school, my mom, she would wake us up with church music. She'll come in our room, she'll have the church music playing and stuff. And we will have to wake up to that. So, you know, when you hear that music all the time, you're gonna try and sing like them. So that's what I did. When I be doing my homework, I end up singing like them. And that's why I got like a little bit of a soul voice. I can change my voice to church sometimes and then I can put it to different ways. So I do have that church voice in me, just so y'all know. And I would just sing the church music all the time. And one time I was in the shower singing in this house when I was like 10. And my sister that's a little bit older than me, three years older than me, not the one that y'all seen on, um, I think my last video or a different one. Y'all don't probably know her. She came into the shower when I was in the bathroom. Well, I was in the shower. She came in cause she heard me singing and she was like, wow, Zachary, your voice is actually, it sounds good. Maybe when you get older, you can become a singer if you continue to sing. Like, and you know, when you're 10, you're younger in general, when people tell you stuff like that, you're gonna obviously wanna keep doing it so that you can accomplish that because you believe what they say because you're 10 or however old you are. So I kept on singing and from that, that really motivated me because that was already my dream to be singing and stuff. Still continue to have dreams of me singing and stuff. Then um, over one summer when I was 13, I had lost my voice because you know, when you're 13, you're starting to hit puberty and stuff. My voice started to get a little bit deeper. So I had lost my singing voice. Couldn't sing that whole summer. Then when I came back to New York, I started to sing this Chris Brown song. So I got my voice back and I learned how to sing in a deeper tone or like just different tones, tones that match with my voice type. And from there, I just kept on singing and like I'll be singing outside when I'm walking home from school and stuff. I did my eighth grade talent show um, and a lot of people knew that I knew how to sing and they will always ask me. Sometimes people from the streets outside, they're like, oh my God, you have an amazing voice and stuff. I always had got compliments and stuff on my voice. And then eventually this year, recently, I was outside um, with my mom and my stepdad and we was coming from Walmart and I was outside putting the bags in the car. And singing is just a part of my life. Like I will always sing all the time. So I was singing and putting the grocery bags in the car, singing the national anthem. And this guy, he comes up to me, 
he's like oh you have an amazing voice and stuff like that oh he gave me money and stuff he asked me to re-sing again my mom heard that he told my mom oh you need to put him in a studio you need to do all that stuff all that good stuff and stuff he gonna be your money maker and the same day later on that guy he, he was like oh you should put him in the studio my sister called with someone named Lacal, I meant Kels. You know who I'm talking about if he's watching this video. He had invited me to a studio. So the same day I was told to go to a studio, I was also invited to go to one. So that's like a sign, you never know. I went to the studio, I started to um, sing and stuff in the studio just to see how it is and, you know, and try and see if I can make any music. And I actually did. It's really hard to, do that stuff it's hard you gotta have your voice a certain way and stuff and then from there this summer i was invited to sing at a wedding the wedding i was invited to sing to i i had vlogged it so yeah things just kept on happening for me to sing and for me to sing and things are still happening at this moment and i just feel that god he wants i don't know he just I don't know, because when you have a gift like that, it's for a reason. It's never just for you to just sit there and waste it. So, like, if you have any gift playing basketball, sports, any sports, if you can draw, if you can dance, if you can sing, go get yourself out there and do what you got to do to um, accomplish your dream or just share what you have with everyone else because God gave it to you for a reason. Here I am being an inspiring YouTuber again, but that's okay. But yeah, that's really how I started to sing. I still sing till this day. And yeah, I just wanted to tell y'all this little story time just so y'all can know. Finally, y'all can stop asking me. I will do more covers on my channel because I do enjoy doing covers and stuff. I just need to know what songs y'all want to see so that I can do it. But yeah, I'll be back with another mother freaking video. Stay tuned on my channel and I do have good collabs coming your way. So stay tuned. Tune. It'll probably be my next video. My next video, my next video will probably be a collab. So stay tuned for that. Like seriously, stay tuned. Stay tuned. Peace.